with the CC12 base point coming in on the 1st of October 2023, this will be the last chance to get max risk for CC. If you are a veteran, this is the Medal of Honor, the medal that proves your hard work as a doctor in Rhode Island. There is going to be this new mode that replaces CC. This is why this video is made. The first and last max risk preparation guide for CC12 base point, presented by Archive. What operators do you need to have? Need to train? What potentials are needed? What strategies have reached the peak? And which strategies are still open for peak finders to leave their own footprint in history? There are three main strategies that already reached the peak. Being sleep, slow, and artless. Rated by Project Arc, Team Shadow God, and Babel Tower. I will be going through all three set strategies, sharing my thoughts of each and one of them, and listing out the operator requirements needed for each of the strategies. First, we are going through Project Arc's sleep core strategy. Starting off with the flag pipe, which consists of Sailage, Elysium, while also setting up the core of sleep strategy, Liskarm and Black Knight. With Liskarm as the SP charger for Black Knight to keep sleep the en new enemies that spawn. With Heart there to, to pull the enemies for Liskarm. To be precise, choosing specific enemies with Cliff Heart skill to let Liskarm tank attacks from enemies that are tankable with only one medic. Also playing Silence being the only medic who can provide heal in two spots on the field on the same time. Glada right there is to pull the enemies into the range of Black Knight and also block some enemies in order for Black Knight to consecutively apply sleep on the enemies together with Kafka. When Gladia's HP is low because of the absence of medic, they replaced Gladia with Mostima here for the absurd slow effect that she provides in her attack range when the skill tree is on, to further keep the incoming enemies in their dreams. The boss is immune to sleep and silence, and this is why Hoshiguma is placed to block the boss path, built by Silence Drone. Since the boss is still above 50% HP, the boss will not gain attack and Hoshiguma can attack the boss from time to time, while slowly using various operators to clear the troop of sleeping enemies at the top side. After the top troops are clear, they change the formation into what you see now. Using Mostima to provide the consistent slow in her attack range, Elysium skill when needed for the skill of Cliffheart, Gladia, and Weedy to be ready. Keep the boss away from the blue box, and that is it. Overall, the common strategy for Max Risk CC after the release of Black Knight. And in this particular CC12, Project Arc first piled up sleepable enemies while stalling boss and killing weaker enemies from another route. However, I will not be recommending this strategy due to the timing and un additional understanding needed for sleep strategy, as well as the all max potential and max operator usage with no room of substitution. The operators used are as shown. Bubble Tower strategy turns out to be different from what the two other two uses. This from the tag used, taking the Avenger increased attack tag rather than the conventional increased attack speed tag, and also having guards as main DPS instead of specialist stalling strategy. The operators they use are showed, so not going to restate them out. Well, when compared to the first strategy, this strategy prioritizes on killing the enemies after gathering them into small clumps. and also using Helaga to handle a few weaker enemies that became elite because of the tags.
after the respawn, we see the Arts Burst in play and finishing off the boss. When compared to Physical Burst, Arts Burst has a higher potential when facing stronger enemies because of the damage calculation mechanism and it's more entertaining. Overall, also a nice strat which requires you to be at least be a Leviathan to qualify for the strategy, with 12 pot 6 6 stars and a spectre. Not recommended, although the timing might be a bit easier than the first one. This particular strategy requires a lot of money investment into your account, and 13 operator slots are all used. Plus, I'm going to be introducing the Team Shadow Guards slow strategy, which is what I'm going to be recommending and using it myself when attempting max risk. This is more possible for Dolphin Doctors because only 9 operator slots are used. Before going into the battle record, I would first share the operators that can be used and substitute, or add it into the squad, as well as the requirements needed. Main concept here is to stall the enemies by slowing with Cliffheart, Spectre Alter Doll, Manticore, and Chen Alter or Mostima S3, together with Feeter or Weedy plus Texas Alter, Phantom Alter. For the other lane, Penent will be soloing it, while Texas Alter and Yato Alter can be used to kill the invisible mages wandering around Lost. There are a few variations and there is more space for adjustment of the operators and this is why I will be recommending an attempt at starting the strategy if you are trying to peak CC12. Okay, this is it. If you have any questions, you can always leave a comment in the comment section below. I'll try my best to help you out. 9th of October 2023, 1am GMT plus 8. See you on YouTube. I'll be streaming live and conquering CC12 base point max risk.